Hello, this is Ronnie. I'm back here with a clip taken from a long video that I just finished to record for my subscribers. I'm leaving the option for my services at 50% off for the first year open and I'll be providing further details after the clip ends. So if you're interested, please stay on. I'll be talking to you again at the end of the uh, clip. I would like you also to read carefully the disclaimer that I'm going to put up now so that uh, it is clear to you before you uh, go ahead and watch the video. This is uh, just a standard thing. This is uh, the chart of sports silver priced in US dollars, that's the daily scale. And I remain reasonably convinced that we should not expect at this point uh, really a run up. I think that silver is definitely not ready. Silver and gold uh, do need to consolidate further and maybe even visit lower grounds for quite a while before they are ready to continue higher. Um, I do see this as an ABC um, no issue there. I think we had uh, an ABC most likely terminated here and the decline here could be taken as an A on the daily scale, further lateral movement and then I would expect further decline. Okay, further decline potentially towards 22. I don't see any problem with that. Uh, you know I'm wrong. You know there is potentially different structure that is evolving here if it is strong enough to climb above this level, above 25. Okay, if in the coming week it is strong enough to climb back above 25, to climb against the resistance line coming down here and sitting on top of 25, then I think that uh, there is scope for it to continue higher. I don't know how far it's going to go higher. It's possible that what uh, in fact will happen is that this A will pick up this, everything that you see here is a B, and the jump will just going to be a C meaning you're going to end up with an A, B, C, A, B, C, and then boom, it's going to come down again, okay? And all this uh, reading that I'm presenting to you is emanating from the fact that I do not think that we have a complete pattern right here. Yeah, I don't see all the elements um, that would justify calling this a complete pattern. Uh, now let's go and see the details. Let's go and see the 60 minutes. And right now, it looks like it is in the midst of a downtrend. Okay, um, that is still my best assessment. But uh, as I explained, any rally and sitting above 25, something that I observed already several days ago, and I alerted you to that, uh, any rally would, um, would be a danger for the shorts. Uh, but any checking of the floor here that of 23.50 continuing to go sideways, certainly breaking down uh, in the coming week, uh, you can expect a, a retest of this level, definitely 21.65. Now, this is uh, the chart of gold, that's uh, spot gold price in US dollars, that's the four hour scale. And also here, we do have the potential for the, um, if you like, the model is through here for the last uh, week or so um, of turning into a B, which in, in turn will open the gate for this. But I absolutely do not see the potential right now for this. No, no, I tell you flat outright, I do not see this coming right now. I think there is still more work necessary here 
to finish this uh, uh, lengthy uh, fourth wave. What I what I assume is a fourth wave in the case of gold. Yes. So we have an ABC which is behind us. I'm treating this as an ABC potentially behind us. And as I said, I could be wrong. If this is an A, that's a B. We'll have a jump C that will probably find some very, very tough overhead resistance in this zone. And this is coming at 1,980, 1,960. Yeah, it's going to get a knock from this level and it is very likely to come back. Uh, yeah, so how would you play that? Well, I think in terms of uh, trading it very, very short term, I don't see really very good odds uh, for uh, going up, nor for going down. So I would avoid uh, trying to um, time or trade it very, very short term. Uh, when it comes to long term investments, uh, when you're thinking about the various uh, major gold, gold and silver producers, I wouldn't say that uh, getting the miners at current levels is a bad idea yeah especially if you are into accumulating uh new positions over time um I, I don't think it's really a bad idea it looks to me like it's fairly stable markets do correct you know uh if it's going to drop by half a percent one percent on a miner that shouldn't really worry too much i do not see a, a massive slump uh, you know around the corner that's the weekly and uh, we still like this as a, you can see as a, as a fourth wave we are treating this as one two that could be taken as a three or that's another one two which is not out of question but this is obviously uh, corrective you know in some uh, technical analysis language you would call it uh, a flag yes um, in terms of the Elliott Ray principle, we are uh, calling this uh, a triangle, most likely fourth wave, yes. But whichever way you go about uh, uh, calling it and um, viewing it, it looks like a consolidation after this huge rally. Lots and lots of gains here, perfectly normal. Markets uh, don't go up in a straight line, they correct and this is looking like a typical correction. Uh, some details about my service currently at 50% off for first time users. You need to go on uh, my website, the home page is right here. It's uh, Wave Mastery, www at wavemastery.com. Yeah, point uh, Wave Mastery in one word dot com. That takes you to the home page. You can uh, scroll down, look through some things that I've written here, some recommendations from past users and current users. And that is essentially the offer currently open uh, only to first time subscribers. OK, so there is the daily service, uh, daily videos that are preceded by trial. So you can take the trial for uh, one week. And at the end of that, if you're happy, you do nothing, you go on to the plan of um, half price, essentially 79 presents half price of the normal price, and that will be good for one year. That means uh, 12 um, payments of 79. Uh, if you want to watch just the weekend videos, then you go for this one, and uh, it does give you access to um, the weekend videos, and uh, I often also insert a video as a bonus uh, midweek, just to keep you on track to see a little bit, uh, you know, where things are moving because sometimes one week of full price action is a lot and the wave count can change, especially if you're a short term trader and you really want to know uh, what's happening. So that is essentially the situation. If you decide to go, for example, for the daily videos, you uh, click here, it takes you to the page where it explains to you, you should read that. It explains to you what um, what is covered, etc., etc. If you like what you read, you click here, subscribe. It takes you to uh, PayPal uh, because of my uh, paying system is through PayPal, and um, you pay through PayPal. You can see you have the trial at nine ninety nine. That's uh, for the first seven days. As I said, if you like what you see, do nothing. It just it just goes automatically. If you don't like, you can cancel. Or if you don't know how to cancel or you have any doubt, you have any question, you can write to me, of course. 
uh, once you go through and you pay, you come back, uh, PayPal will send you back to my website uh, to um, fill in your um, profile details, uh, choose your login, and uh, once you do that, you will be led uh, automatically to the page with, uh, with the links to the various videos classified by date. If at any point in time in this process you have a problem, things are not going uh, as I'm describing to you right now, all you have to do is just contact me and I'll help you out. Um, that is essentially it. So um, you'll have one week to look at things. I would like to just spend a minute uh, about the website itself. I have written here a few articles. Uh, is this website for me? You can go through that one. Psychology and trading, trading and the arts, why join? Yes, each of these articles uh, could uh, perhaps uh, help you to, to see um, how to relate to my website. But there's no substitute, in my opinion, to actually take a trial. You know, you take a trial, and I want to say another thing. You take a trial, and you can't make up your mind. You want more time to think. Fine, I understand that. Then you cancel, but then you are not allowed to take another trial. Please, I want to be very clear about that. There are people who abuse this, and it's really um, not right. Uh, you're not allowed to take more than one trial, okay? A trial is a trial. But if you're interested, after you take a trial, you're interested to come back, you can still benefit from the low price for the next full year, but you have to write to me and then I will send you a special link without a trial. And, and, and if you join then, you're going to go immediately onto the reduced price plan for 12 months. Okay. Uh, if you take another trial after you took already one, I am going to have to cancel that and refund you. And if you do that two or three times, I'm just going to blacklist you because there are people who have been doing it and I'm afraid this is really absolutely not right. Um, this is subscribe here. Uh, use subscription. Once you, are, uh, once you are logged in, you will see this one highlighting you uh, uh, daily service videos or weekend service videos. Yeah, it will show which one you really um, um, have the right to, to access. The daily service videos, to be very clear, they cover the weekend service videos, okay? So you don't have to subscribe to both. The daily covers everything I do. The weekend, of course, is more selective. Now, I have here resources. There are chart galleries right here. Uh, chart one, two, three. There are plenty, plenty of chart, uh, charts here that give you uh, an idea how I go about uh, uh, subdividing uh, various uh, market action here. There, I covered a lot, a lot of markets, and you can see there is history here. It could be very interesting for you to just go through, let's see, Platinum, for example. Yes, that's 1973 to 1978. If you click right on top where it shows you the hand, the chart opens up big. You can print it if you like. Um, here is an example of Platinum, April um, uh, 1980. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, and then the huge correction that followed after that. Uh, so they, there is plenty for you, whichever market you're interested, uh, interested in the financials, uh, commodities, precious metals, etc. Uh, okay, so that chart galleries, then useful links, as it as the name implies. Yes, recommended reading list. You have uh, a long list of uh, books here that I've read over the years. That I found very interesting. Of course, I have many more books that uh, I would like to add. It's just a question of time. I don't always have time to update this one. But the books that you find here uh, did help me in the beginning. And still, uh, the information here is very valuable in these books. For example, Kroll. I don't know how many of you heard about Stanley Kroll. Stanley Kroll was um, a really imaginative fellow trader uh, that wrote... Um, wrote very well about his own trading and in trading in general. I learned a lot from uh, from these books. And of course, uh, if you haven't heard about uh, Reminiscence of a Stock Operator, you should uh, get this book and read it. Uh, you will not regret. Uh, this is uh, uh, a book that um, most traders, I think, uh, have come across and read. It is very, very interesting. 
And uh, as you go down the list, you will see there are things that are of interest to you. Uh, of course, uh, go ahead, get them. Some of them are in, even available online for free as a PDF. Uh, check that. Uh, if you have questions about that, you can even uh, contact me. Here's the contact us and you uh, put your name. Please make sure you give me the right email address. Message, simple maths, submit, I get it. You'll hear from me. I'm based in Belgium. So if you write to me from Australia or from the US and I'm having uh, my arrest, do not be surprised if I don't react quickly, okay? Uh, normally within, uh, within a day you will have a reply for me. I, I check my email uh, uh, fairly regularly. So that's about it. Hope to see you visiting my website. Hope to see you taking a trial. Um, if you have any questions, again, don't hesitate. Get in touch with me and uh, wishing you great trading week. Bye now.